steady through the highs and lows. Close. We are gathered here to witness Kennedy Renee Benzi and Michael James Lenati Jr. Surrounded by the beauty of God's creation and nurtured by the sights and sounds of nature to celebrate their wedding. Kennedy, when we decided to write our own vows, I was a little freaked out and nervous as there's no way to truly express the love I have for you. Then I realized I got to go first. <laughs> but when I sat down to write these, it was easier than I could have ever imagined. Michael, I feel so blessed that after today I get to call myself your wife. You make me feel safe. You acknowledge my strengths while accepting my faults. Your blind kindness that you extend to everyone, even strangers, makes me want to be a better person, and your outspoken confidence continuously pushes me to new experiences. I met Kennedy at a sorority event my freshman year. And if I had known the odds of Kennedy ever attending a sorority function, I would have realized immediately that we were destined to be lifelong friends. The odds were definitely in my favor that day. And not only did Kennedy become my big, she also became my best friend. I was in my third year at Reinhardt University. Lenati and I met, we played baseball up there together. And I met this loud little cocky Italian kid who came into school and thought he was gonna take over the team and take over the campus. And how we ever became best friends is beyond me, but we did. Kennedy and Michael is this promise between two people who love each other who honor one another as individuals and who wish to spend the rest of their lives together. It enables the two separate souls to share their desire, longings, dreams, and memories, their joys and sorrows to help each other through the uncertainties of life. When I say I love you more, I mean I love you more than the bad days ahead of us. I love you more than any fight we may ever have. I love you more than anything or anyone that's ever tried to get between us. And today I promise to be your navigator and your partner in all of life's adventures. I promise to encourage your passions and support your dreams, because that is what makes you unique and wonderful. I'm in constant awe of your intelligence and willpower as I have witnessed your personal and professional growth flourish over these years as you put your all into things you love. I'm so grateful that you are my best friend, my rock, and look forward to seeing what God will grace us with in the future. I promise to be a shoulder to cry on and to help you through any challenges because together it's us against the world and there's nothing we can't overcome. I promise to laugh at your terrible jokes and to never go to bed angry. Most of all, I promise to love you unconditionally for forever and always, and nothing will change that. I pray that at the end of our lives together, we will look more like Christ than we do now because of the fruit of our marriage. I vow to be yours today, tomorrow, and forever. I love you with all my heart. Michael and Kennedy, you have come here today of your own free will and is in the presence of family and friends have declared your love and commitment to each other. And by the power vested in me and the state of Georgia, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now share your first kiss as husband and wife. Congratulations. Kennedy and Michael are forming a family today, but we are also honored to be gaining Michael as a member of our family. And we look forward to watching them grow together as they journey through life. And Laura and I commit to being there for you during the good times and especially during the inevitable downturns in life. And we'll help you through those.
Once I met Michael, I could see how perfect they were for each other. Plus, everyone always needs an attorney friend. (laughs) Having both of them as my friends, or as I refer to them as my mom and dad, makes tonight even more special. I wish both of you the best in life and love, and may you always be as happy you are in this moment. I think you are both better together. I think you make each other better. And I've had the pleasure of seeing you both grow and start a life together. This is your wedding. It's one journey, one moment of many that you will share. And I know looking back, it will be a blur, but I am damn proud to be here and share it with you two amazing people that I love dearly. outlook combined with Michael's passion and energy will lead to happiness and certain synergies that make one plus one equal three. My advice to you guys is to treat every day as special and look into each other's eyes and remember the love you feel in your hearts today, even during the most mundane and routine tasks in your life. (laughs) 